Um, I think it's important to remember and to keep in mind that the fundamental purpose of going from 100 hertz to 200 hertz is to create vivid and clear picture quality without any motion blur or artifacts. Now that's a core essence of Boeing. If the, if the technology does not deliver that, it's basically no reason to come up with a new technology because this is not a, a competition about most frequency. It's not a competition about most components in the TV. It's all about picture quality. Um, and as you know, there are two different kinds of 200 hertz uh, technology on the market, or I can say there's two ways of achieving 200 hertz. Um, our system is what we call scanning backlight. So what that means is that we use a combination of MEMC algorithms and scanning backlight to create 200 hertz. The other way is MEMC type, which basically uses MEMC algorithms to create the additional frames and get 200 hertz. Make no mistake about it, both of the technologies deliver 200 hertz. Okay? Um, and we chose uh, backlight scanning, um, and I'll explain why we think this is the best technology. Now, on the top side, you can see basically the MEMC uh, way of doing it. Because going from 50 hertz, or the original picture, to 200 hertz, you, you need to make one frame, four frames. So you need to add another three frames into the equation. So the way the MEMC does it is that it, based on one picture and the next picture, it calculates the movements in between and fills them in. Our way of doing that is to use one additional picture, but we use the backlight scanning and we change it between the center block and the upper lower block to fill in the remaining picture. So we also have exactly four additional frames onto the picture. Now, in all honesty, uh, the MEMC um, display here shows the same picture three times. Usually that is not the case. Uh, it will be calculated, it will be different, but this is a golf swing, and it's not my golf swing, so it's probably very fast, and in those cases, the, 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 the algorithms wouldn't be able to kind of calculate. So in that case, they put in the same picture. But usually, it will be three different pictures. As I said, we use one picture, and we use the scanning backlight to create the additional picture. 